Hello, my name's Austin Jarrett from Alit Mowers. Today I want to do a little bit of an experiment. Uh, we have the new Liberty mower here, which is a lithium ion powered mower. And I also have a conventional rotary mower. I also have a lawn that needs cutting. And this lawn is about 375 square meters. So what I'm really interested to do is to try and understand how much it's going to cost me to mow this with an ordinary rotary mower, a good rotary mower, with a petrol engine, and we're going to measure the fuel, and what it's going to cost me in terms of a discharge of a battery on a Liberty cylinder mower. And that way it'll just give me an idea in terms of how much it's costing me to mow and how I can justify buying a Liberty mower with a lithium ion battery. So the way I'm going to do this is I've got my petrol can here. I'm going to fill the tank of this Honda mower so it's absolutely full and then I'm going to mow the whole area and then I'm going to fill it back up and I'm going to measure very carefully using this fuel measuring uh, uh, device so that I can understand exactly how much fuel I've used and then I can work out the cost of mowing. And then the other thing I'm going to do is, this is the lithium ion battery, I'm going to mow until I completely discharge this mower and then I'll be able to work out, with a clever little bit of maths, actually how much electricity I've used because I can measure the amount of energy it takes to recharge this battery over the same area of the mower and I can do it, of the petrol mower and then I can do an exact comparison. So first I'm going to use the rotary mower, I'm going to set the height of cut quite high. I'm going to collect the grass clippings in both the tests and ideally I want to collect the same amount of grass clippings with the rotary mower as I do with the cylinder mower so I'm just going to play with that to make sure I, I can get that as close as possible. So I'm going to collect the grass clippings in both tests and I'm going to put them in the wheelie bin. Um, I, I'm going to Try and make sure that I overlap absolutely dead right as well to make sure the tests are com comparable between the two. Um, uh, but the height of cut is going to be the main thing. I'm going to be cutting higher with the rotary mower, which it's better at. Uh, and then I'll cut lower with the cylinder mower, which it's better at, uh, in order to try and harvest the same amount of grass. So, off we go. So we've mown this lawn here, about 375 square metres. Uh, it took about 21, 22 minutes, just for reference. Um, and uh, I've got a, a wheelie bin that's about half full of clippings, but we'll look at that later. Uh, so what I'm going to do now is work out how much fuel it's taken to mow this area. So I've got my little measurer here, and I've put in 300 millilitres of fuel. And so what I'm going to do now is fill the tank back up to the brim, and that will be the amount of fuel that we've used in order to mow this lawn. And I will be able to work out then by how much fuel I use out of this measurer uh, as to how much fuel I've used. So if I fill this right up to the brim. So you can see 120 millilitres is remaining. That means from the 300 millilitres I originally had in the measurer here, that I've now used 180 millilitres in order to mow that 375 square metres of lawn with this rotary mower at this height. So for the second part of the test, we're now going to work out how much area we can mow with one complete discharge of a lithium ion battery. So I've checked that this is fully charged and I've got my four lights on the battery. I'm going to put this into the machine and I'm going to keep mowing until it stops. I'm going to be cutting grass and I'm going to be emptying it into the second wheelie bin now so that we'll have some sort of comparison to make sure that we've cut about the same amount of grass. So as part of this test now, I've just used Liberty 43 to mow this 375 square metre lawn. Uh, I've just done that now in about 15 minutes. 
So 15 minutes and also the grass clippings I've taken off of there are very comparable with the rotary mower. So if you just come and take a look in this grease grass box, you'll see the two different grass box contents. This is the cylinder mower and then this is the rotary mower. And you'll see there's very similar quantities uh, when I've mown this lawn once with each machine at two different heights, remember, lower height on the Liberty. Just uh, measure the lawn and verify the dimensions because that's important. We've mown the lawn in two and a half, uh, two and a half times in total. Uh, so we'll work out the area. So I have uh, 24.5 meters is the longest length. And then along the short length, this is the most inefficient way of mowing lawn across this length. We'll see what dimension we get there. And I'm coming in with a width dimension of 14.8 meters. So we'll multiply those two together and we'll work out the total area of the lawn. So this has been a really interesting experiment. So we've worked out how much it's going to cost the, to mow using a uh, petrol engine rotary mower and we've compared it with the lithium ion uh, cylinder mowing machine. So they're not like for like mowers and I'm not comparing power sources per se but what I'm doing is just making a comparison because actually I would normally have no idea how much it costs for me to mow my lawn. So we mowed the lawn in its entirety once 375 square meters we mowed it with this mower, the rotary mower, we filled it up with petrol to the top and then we put uh, 180 millilitres of fuel to top it back up after we'd mown. So to mow this lawn once, it, co it cost us 0.18 of a litre and today we have been and purchased fuel in order to do that at £1.20 per litre. So by multiplying one pound 20 times 0.18 liters, we will end up with a cost of 21.6 pence at British fuel prices today to mow this whole lawn area, 21.6 pence. We've also taken the lithium ion machine and we've mown this until we ran the entire battery out. So to run the whole entire battery out, we actually mowed this lawn two and a half times before the battery then stopped giving us power. We've also measured how much energy, how many kilowatt hours went in to recharge a battery in its entirety back up to full charge. And that took 0.14 kilowatt hours. And we, uh, we pay, in this country, we pay about 10.5 pence per kilowatt hour. Um, so actually that works out at about three and a half pence per complete charge for that. And I'm gonna, let's call it five pence. Um, there are some inefficiencies and things that can go on. So let's call it five pence a charge on this, on this battery. But I did manage to mow the lawn two and a half times. So really to do a di direct comparison for five pence worth of mowing uh, of electricity to mow with the lithium ion machine, I will have to multiply my 21.6 pence by two and a half times. Which I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna compare five pence actually with the two and a half times, which is 54 pence. So you can see it's over 10 times the amount of cost for the electrical charge as it is for the petrol. So I think that's pretty good. Thank you.